Dumpling, bao, vegetable, and also potato. And just like the usual, I'm just gonna watch friends while I'm enjoying my meal. Basically, this is the bathroom area. It's actually quite spacious, so it's more like an um, apartment type. I put my luggage here, um, and basically, this is the entire room. I'm glad they give us um, a desk and a chair so I can work or do my stuff. Um, this is the view that I got. We are pretty much not in a city area, so it's like an hour away or so. We have this big window, but unfortunately, we are not able to open it. Like, this is the most that I can open. But it's nice since you still get fresh air in. But yeah. <laughs> Hi everyone, hello from Guilin, China. So I finally made it here um, and I'm just doing my two weeks of quarantine in the dormitory area. So yeah, welcome to my temporary dorm. And also since it's officially December, um, I thought I'm gonna share a little bit about like setting goals and my intention for New Year. First, let me show you the planner that I got for 2023. It's from the brand White Bridge from Indonesia. I love it so much. The quality is really good. I love a planner when it's hardcover. And then I actually already fill in a little bit. So outer page just looks amazing. So they got some like reflection that you can get. Like um, last year reflection and then things you want to accomplish for the new year. I'm not going to bother you guys with what I wrote. <laughs> it's kind of personal um, but yeah I like that they have different templates on every page um, but the thing that makes me pick this journal is I love it when they give you the freedom to fill in the calendar also like you can fill in your focus for the month and they also give you the other like white blank where you can fill other things you want to put in um, for the rest of the month and I love it when they have something like this, so something you're upset about, something you're happy about, so just a little thing where you can check in with yourself about how you're feeling throughout the week. And yeah, so this is my favorite um, template for um, a weekly to-do list because then you can put your overall weekly overview on the left side and then on the right side you can just like schedule everything. 
And then also by the end of the month, you also have this expense or financial tracker, um, which I think is really useful. Like one of my goals this year is to track my expenses and be better at my financial goals. But I personally wouldn't use this one because I prefer to track my expenses through my phone because I bring my phone everywhere. So every time I purchase something or like I pay for something and just put it on an app. The other page that I'm really excited to fill in is this self check-in um, page because I think it's really really important to like write down your short-term goals like um, your goals for the year but sometimes we get lots of touch of like what actually we are want to like pursue in our lives so I think it's really important to know what your long-term goals is and then here I love the prompt that they have in here where do you want to be in a year what are my long-term goals what do I love about my current life um, how do I describe my ideal life what am I afraid of, of this life? Um, what does happiness mean to me? What have I forgave myself for? Who are the people in my life that make me the happiest? I think they put a really good prompt on this page. So yeah, I can't wait to like um, fill it in and see like where my mind takes me. But yeah, so if you guys are trying to find a journal that you can use for the new year, I highly recommend this one. I think they come in three different colors, but I picked this terracotta one.